is going on, fellas? Welcome to the video. Welcome back to the Porsche. We're back in the Porsche today. I'm excited. I've missed this car. You guys might think I've forgotten about it, and that's kind of because I have. We've been just a little busy lately with everything. So this car has been neglected, and I can't have it at the apartment because we can't have too many cars there. Um, they only let us have two cars. We've got mine and Madison's. And so that's it. So Porsche stays at my dad's house, which he's totally fine with. He's having he's having plenty of fun with this thing and doing more stuff to it than I would be able to do to it at the moment anyways. So second gear. Here we go. Here's our little film spot and uh, I'll show you guys what we've done to it. We've done a little bit of things to it, some upgrades here and there. Um, word to the wise before I show you guys what we're doing to it or what we've done to it. Um, if you're a purist and you like things to be restored back to factory spec and factory everything, don't watch this video. However, I'm pleased to say that I've gone into second twice and it hasn't grinded. I don't, I don't think transmissions fix themselves, but it still hesitates a lot. But eh, that's pretty good. Man, I miss this car, dude. Look how smooth this car is. It's just little and fun and we put some new seats in. I'll show you guys the seats when I get out of it. We put just like some, you know, Cheap racing seats in it just to give it a different seat because you remember the sort the seats that we had were really bad. So put some other seats in it so it's actually really comfortable. I mean the big bolsters in them like really big, but even me being a big guy, it's actually not bad. I like it. Then it's very firm. It's gonna keep wiggling. We haven't done a whole lot to it, mostly just because you know time. We've all been so busy getting ready for this wedding. Um, that it just time to play has been very short. Um, so we've done a little, we've done a few things to it here and there just to kind of make it more, I guess, presentable if you want to call it that. Um, we'll start really tearing into this thing probably more in the springtime when it warms up a little bit and uh, we have time to just kind of rip into it. Um, but for right now, just kind of enjoying it. Just a big dump truck. Just a happy, happy little car. You guys want a little second gear pull? Yeah, the car in front of me. I wanted to make this video because, you know, like I said, I haven't gotten a chance to, wow, you guys are dark. I haven't gotten a chance to play with this car in a while. Now you guys are really bright. And um, I know I have gotten a, a lot of comments saying, hey, what's, what's the deal with the Porsche? Do you still have it? So, yes, I still have it. It's still here. And uh, so we're pulling into our little corner now where I film pretty much all my videos. And uh, I'll kind of walk you guys what we've done to it so far and uh, and what the plans for it is in the future. All right, fellas. Well, sorry if there's a little wind. It's a little windy today. But here she is, man, in all of her fleeting glory. So we're able to bust the paint out pretty well. Um, and this is just still the same paint and hat on. If you guys remember, um, we first picked it up, I mean, it was <laughs> borderline gray. I wouldn't call it black. It's definitely black now. Um, the paint actually cleaned up nicely. Obviously, it's not perfect. There's still a lot of love that needs to be done on it. But um, for the most part, man, it actually cleaned up pretty nice. So my dad did a, he did a real bang up job buffing this thing out. So he's a wizard with it. So made it look a lot better. So things we've done to it. So let's go inside first. So that handle still doesn't work. You got to go through the, through the window. So big thing is the seats. Seats really just kind of freshened the car up a lot more. Just, you know made it you know the seats were ugly so we've done that let me get in oh. all that same gauge is the same everything's fine um this plastic was all dry so we just did it's like a you know whatever cheap carbon fiber overlay thing i don't know it doesn't look that bad it'll probably change eventually but uh logan bought that so the old stereo wasn't working and i know <laughs> if any 911 peers are going to watch this video, they're like, oh, you can't replace that stereo. It's super special and worth a lot of money. We did. And oh well. Um, so we did that. Uh, I'm not sure what the purpose of that is, but it's a quarter right there. Um, but yeah, you know, the interior is not too bad. It just needed a little bit of love. And uh, so I said, more stuff will happen to it eventually. But for right now, this is, this is what it is. So looks pretty dang good, actually. And it's got a radio, which it didn't have before, which is sweet. So yeah, not a whole lot to talk about here. We'll go. So outside the car, we replaced all these rock guards because those were all cracked and crappy. So we replaced them on all four wheels. 
Um, gave it a good clean. We replaced the hood shocks. So now yeah, when you open the hood, it goes up and it actually holds it by its own. I don't know if I even showed you guys under the hood of this thing. It's super clean, very stock, and uh, yeah, very clean. Not a whole lot to report on that, which is nice. The less things to report under the hood, the better. So that's really about it, man. All we've really done is just clean. Oh, the only other thing we did, and a lot of the NA guys do this, we did it too, is we pushed this bumper back a little bit. So eventually we'll replace it with a turbo bumper, but for now, we just pushed it back just to kind of give the front end a little bit of a cleaner face. So, but that's really it, man. She's just a cute, fun car. I love this thing so much. I'm sad I haven't gotten to play with it more. But, uh, oh, and <laughs> we need to put a little exhaust tip on it. So, I don't know. Jury's still out on that one. I don't think it looks bad. I think it kind of just matches with the car fine. But uh, here she is, man. 944, still alive, still kicking. And uh, yeah, so let's get back in and drive it because it's more fun driving than looking at it. Okay. And so, okay. Matt's a little loose, no big deal. Starter still didn't sound great. But she fires right up. I really do like these seats. They're really comfy and obviously way comfier than the last seats because the last seats were torn to bits. So, you actually have a stereo now? Oh yeah, high quality. But it, it works better than what it was. Oh, it turns out you can't go if the hand breaks up. So you can't do any hard first and second shifts. Once you're in second, then uh, just go for it. And 4,000 RPMs. because the speedometer doesn't work still but it felt pretty quick i've always been a firm believer in you know new technology i love new cars like i love my car to death it's so much fun to drive but there's just something just special about driving a car like this you know i feel like i don't know it, driving older cars just i said you know i said it when i first you know, made the video about this car they just they take you back in time to a different place you know where there was less distractions, you know? I mean, there's no Bluetooth, and there's no Apple CarPlay, and there's no anything. It's just driving. It's just a five-speed and a horn. You know, this car was made back when the ultimate driving car was important. You know, just how does the car drive? Not, not what's in the car, not what kind of tank it has, but just how good does it drive? That's what was important. So, Plans for this car are crazy. We don't want to do a whole lot of stuff to it just yet. Like I said, we're going to probably wait until the spring to start even looking at doing bigger things. Um, we've got a set of uh, aftermarket wheels that are going to go on. And I think these wheels are bad. Um, I know they're very period, very quick. But like I said, we're not going for a purist restoration. We're going for a cool car. So, not that I'm saying that old restored horses aren't cool. We're just going for a different look. Um, we've never. My dad and I, we've never really cared about restoring things. Um, yeah, that's really it. We've never cared about restoring things. <laughs> we just always wanted to do things aftermarket and make them cool. So we've got some, some 18s that are about to go on this pretty soon. Um, so that'll definitely change up the looks a little bit. Um, big picture, um, we are going to change, swap the engine eventually. Um, right now it's fine and she is super happy. She's just, you know, just skips along and it's super smooth. So I kind of feel bad wanting to replace the engine, but just doesn't, just not in the plans for the car. And uh, you're not trying to make anything crazy with this car. You know, I mean, we're not trying to make a track monster. We're not trying to make, you know, a, you know, like I said, a track god. All we're trying to do is make kind of a cool grand touring car with this thing. You know, we want to do a lot of road rallies with this car. We want to do, you know, just different things that are fun and interesting. And um, I think the only correct way to do that is if you make this car fun and interesting too. And uh, so we want to do a lot of different things to it. And uh, all in due time, we're not in a huge hurry right now. Obviously we can't, we don't really have <laughs> the time. You know, it's crazy how much time you think you have and then you just don't. But um, for right now, the way it sits, we're having a blast with it. I love this little thing. It just, I really, really miss it. <laughs> really excited I got to drive it today. And, uh, I know a lot of you guys have been asking about it. So it's not gone. It's probably never leaving. Um, just happy as can be 
right now. Just kind of waiting, waiting until we've got the got the time to to really kind of tear into it. So I will make sure that to do some more stuff. I'll put a little more effort into this card and keep you guys updated on it because man, a lot of you guys like these little cards. That the video we made, just doing the little review of it, kind of did really well. So we'll keep making more videos about the Porsche. So apparently you guys like this thing, and which makes sense. I do too. It's a perfect little car. It's a good car. Thank you. It's just so happy. It's just like, it's like I promise you I'm fast. Well guys, there it is. There's your little 944 update. Um, I got a few hours to kill, so I'm probably just gonna go enjoy the Porsche. So I'll catch you guys in the next video. I love you guys. And uh, if you guys are watching this video, I'm in Mexico right now. So I'm probably not wearing a hoodie. And I'm probably very happy because I'm very full. I have a lot of tacos in my stomach. So I'll see you guys when I get back. Appreciate you guys watching. As always, love you guys. Um, and then bye.